video. To complete this project, you'll only need a few items. And the first item is a bulletin board. I got this one from TJ Maxx a few years ago. So we're just gonna start by taking sheets of paper and layering the inside of the frame. Definitely didn't wanna stick with the ugly green frame, so I'm gonna be using Rust-Oleum American Accent Spray Paint in a shiny gold finish. So you just wanna give your can a few shakes to get the paint mixed up nice and well. And you'll go ahead and start spraying. As you can see on the top of my spray can, I actually have a spray gun top. And this you can actually pick up from Walmart or any hardware store, it's only $2. But it helps distribute your paint evenly throughout your project. When I'm spray painting projects, the spray gun top is a must because it helps me to spray evenly without having those ugly runs. So just keep spraying until your frame is completely coated in the gold spray paint. And if your paper keeps lifting like mine did, just use a little bit of painter's tape. So after you're done spray painting the gold, just let the chalkboard sit for about 30 minutes so that the gold spray paint can completely dry because you're gonna to wanna to tape off the outer edges with some painter's tape or some clear masking tape and paper like I did. Sorry that this part of the video is so shaky. I actually have my five-year-old helping me film. So I guess she thought this would be a cool effect. Because this is cork board, um, cork has the tendency to absorb liquid. So I did have to use a couple of coats of the chalkboard spray paint in order to get a solid finish. So this is the finished result and I am so happy with